and standing by it with how yours can make a difference in a child's life. You know, I love to save uh, Christmas cards every year. Look back at them uh, before you decide what to do with them and then come up with ways to uh, reuse some of those. So earlier we showed you uh, some fun ideas. I like to take uh, the picture cards and put them into a little uh, book with rings. So you can go back and look at all the fun ones that your friends have sent you from the years. It's fun, too, to see how your kids have grown up. Or your dogs, Courtney. Yeah. Ending, oh, I'm Eber. <laughs> uh, I also like to take Christmas cards and cut them down and make uh, tags and labels out of them uh, to use on Christmas cards the next year. So we looked at this card uh, earlier uh, this morning. It had a little uh, Christmas stocking on the front. So we just cut it out. Boom. Just like boom. that. Put a little uh, hole uh, in the corner with my hole punch. And then just take a little uh, tag there because I also love to say ribbon. And then you go. And look at that. You got a little Christmas card tag How for your packages for next year. Super easy fun project that. for your kids. Another thing you can do is uh, upcycle them. The St. Jude's Ranch for Children in Boulder uh, City, Nevada, which is just right outside uh, Las Vegas near the dam there, uh, loves to get Christmas card fronts that they then take and make into new Christmas cards to sell um, to help benefit the programs that provide teenagers with life and work skills in Nevada. So, uh, cool. But they only want a particular kind of cards. They want the front only uh, from cards. Uh, no Hallmark, no American Greetings, no Disney cards. I would assume that those are probably copyrighted images mm -hmm. and they don't want those. Uh, so what you would do is look through uh, fun cards. Let's see, I'm trying to find, like, uh, pretty much all of these would work. I don't think, I don't think I get any Disney cards uh, anywhere. Um, but they, uh, they, they, you know, I know they've seen, uh, like, religious cards, uh, but they've also taken uh, Santa cards. These might be good to use because you can't recycle cards that have a lot of glitter and things like that on yeah. it. So, oh, yeah. Uh, you can't put those in the recycling bin. So uh, this would be a good one to use uh, for that. Make sure there's nothing on the back. Although I think it's I'm not sure it really matters. They attach it to the front of a new card, so when you open it up, you wouldn't see what's on the back okay. anyway. So just take your Christmas cards, and you want to recycle this little guy. Sorry, guy, you're not going in my uh, Christmas album. I'm going to send you off to <laughs> Thank You Ranch for Children this morning. And uh, just pile them all up. Put them on there and uh, put them in, a, uh, in an envelope and send them to them. The website Perfect. is going to be linked to gooddaysacramento.com. Click show info there at the top of the page and then today's date. Perfect one. Nice and generic there. Uh, and send those uh, cards to them. I've also got a link there where you uh, can choose from about 50 different Christmas card projects. Everything from wreaths to candle holders to you name it. It's there for Christmas cards. Uh, again, on our website under show info and today's date. There you go. And what you can't use, into the recycling bin. Into the recycling. Not in the trash. Guys, back to you. Oh, more good day coming up after the break. <laughs>